We are doing a little update today. What is up guys? Welcome back to the video. Today we are starting out at one of my favorite places, SOS Customs, and we are checking on the R35 GTR as well as officially getting the spray card for the paint color code. SOS has done a little bit of work so far and we're gonna go check out what they've done in the past week with the car and show you guys some of the pieces and you guys can't see the paint card yet. It's gonna be good, so stay tuned. Let's get into the video. Oh my god. This is crazy to see, Saul. So Saul, get in here. I don't show him the car just yet, but how's the process of the 35 been so far? Uh, it's been good. I mean, the fitment of everything has, you know, little stuff here right, that right. we had of to course, take care yeah, of. Of course. But the whole process has been going, you know, overall pretty smooth. So That's I'm awesome, really man. Well, okay, let me show you guys the car. Huge change. Yes, they have completely disassembled the entire car. Now they have started actually sanding down the paint and prepping this thing to get it ready for the complete color change Wow. This is actually crazy. They even started to mold some of the body pieces right here, make the kit fit a little bit better towards the trunk and the rear quarter panel of the car. But they're doing an amazing job on the car so far. And this pains me to see this <laughs> all worn down like this, but I am so stoked for you guys to see the end result of this. It's just gonna, it's gonna blow you guys away. I am beyond excited. So I wanted to come get some progress pictures. I've been saving up tons of different photos that you guys have never seen before for something cool that I'm doing at the end of uh, at the end of this build series. Here's the other side. They haven't quite started on sanding any of this down just yet, but they are doing a little bit of body work on certain things, if there's any dents or whatever. This car is literally about to look completely brand new and it's just gonna be incredible. So this is the R35 update. So as you guys can see, tons of progress on the R35. I am so excited. I'm storing footage that you guys haven't even seen yet. So I'm very excited and I cannot wait to show you this documentary. There is something that I need to say and something that I want you guys to hear regarding the channel and the cars and everything like that. As you guys have probably noticed, there's a ton of fitness content on my channel. If you're new here or if you haven't stayed up to date really, I'm competing in a bodybuilding competition March 28th, which when you're watching this is about two weeks away. Um, these two weeks, my life primarily 95 to 98% preparing for this show. I can't really do much. I'm in a very, very low deficit of food, which means I really don't have energy or anything like that. So I'm trying to push out as much car content as I possibly can. But before I really get into that, I just want to tell you guys that I completely understand that some of you may not be into fitness or you only may want to watch the channel for cars. That is totally cool. With that being said, that for this channel, it's a channel about me and my life. Uh, of course, it will always probably marry be about cars. That's why I started the channel with, but fitness is a huge passion of mine and something that I've grown to really love is making fitness content and promoting how to live a healthy lifestyle while still maintaining your everyday life. Just like working on cars or, you know, if you're going to work and I really enjoy making all of the workout videos, the recipe, the food videos, and it's just something that I truly love. Now I understand that some of you may not be into that. You may only be here for the cars and care at all about the fitness or any aspects like that. That's totally fine. I completely understand. I do want to say that there will be uh, fitness content on this channel. Yes, it may seem like a lot right now, but like I said, it's only because I'm on contest prep and my life right now for the next 14 days or so is primarily about fitness, but I can promise you and assure you guys the car content is not going anywhere. The builds will never stop. The R32 build starts the first week of April. We just got all of the titanium in from Vibrant. We got my brand new ECU, which I, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw what ECU I got. It's just going to be completely completely rad. Uh, I don't want you guys to think that I'm completely transitioning over to fitness content. That is not the case at all. It is just right now, 
that's primarily what I'm doing and I don't want to stop content for you guys and I really do love and enjoy making that fitness content so that's why I'm putting it out to you and I noticed that a lot of you like it yes it may get lower views and of course not as many people are interested in it and that's not what it's about for me it's about me having fun and enjoying the content that I put out which you know makes me feel better when I'm having fun doing something yes I love making the car content as you guys know I just get overly hyped everything about cars and that will never change I decided to share a different different aspect of my life which is fitness with you guys and I hope you guys uh, can appreciate that and grow to like it even if you don't really care about fitness. I'm just promoting a healthy lifestyle and how to actually do everyday things while still living, being healthy, getting your fitness in and that's really what I want to promote uh, to all of you and to my viewers and I just want to make sure that you guys completely understand that the car content isn't going anywhere. We're continuing to do the GTR builds and new builds that you guys have no idea about that I've been working behind the scenes with Japan hand manufacturers. It's just so much is going on that I can't tell you guys about right now, but I promise you and assure you car content will always be here. It is here to stay forever. I'm just sprinkling in just a little bit of some fitness content because uh, it's something that I love and I appreciate and I want to give that content out to all of you guys. It's a lot of fun for me and, and the videos are very, very informative, very fun to watch. So if you have a chance to sit back and relax, maybe while you're eating or anything like that, the fitness content is really great. But okay, that is the main, the main gist of what I wanted to say. Car content isn't going anywhere. Just sprinkles of fitness coming to the channel. These last 14 or so days will be fitness content uh, revolved. So I probably post about one or two videos uh, for these next two weeks. My show is on March 28th. So I uh, will be posting a lot of fitness videos that week leading up to the show. So just want to prepare you guys for that. Don't worry, car content's not going anywhere. After the 28th, we will resume our regularly scheduled build series updates starting with the R35 and the R32. GTR. That was a mouthful. You guys got to see the R35 update here. This is where we currently stand. Uh, if you have questions about when this car is going to get done, it will be done at the end of March, early April, and we are doing a reveal at the Super Street Studio in Los Angeles. It will be open to the public. It's going to be a cool little car meet, but I cannot reveal this until we have an official date for the reveal party in April. So the car will be done early April and will be released mid-April. So that's the timeline that we're looking at for the reveal of the R35, but I will give you guys updates just like this throughout the entire process so you don't forget about it. Now, I need to go find where my spray car is, and I think they actually primed a couple of pieces of the wide body. Let's go check it out. All right, so we made it inside of the warehouse, and we have a couple of pieces primed up and ready to go. As you guys can see, we have the various front bumper here. We have the rear bumper, side skirts, and the front fenders. They're going to do the actual car once, once all of this is done, but it's so crazy to see all of these pieces is like completely primed like it's real it's getting real and this color is gonna blow everybody away so have you seen it you've seen the color dude it's killer right it's so do you have the the spray card by any chance i think so yes so grab the spray card today but yeah everything is coming out perfect and i'm going to show you guys step by step at uh literally everything that happens so right now we are in primer stage and once they start on the actual gtr i'm going to come film some of that process and show you guys exactly how they're sanding the car down and how they're actually going to start priming the car because that's going to be a big job a full color change is a lot it's about to be sick so this is where we're at That is the update on the R35. Like I said, I will be here consistently through the weeks to show you guys all the progress that's being made on the car, but I'm gonna go check out the spray card and then we are gonna actually go hit some legs. You guys that are watching the fitness videos have been asking to see a leg workout. I'm working out with my gym partner today, Russell, and he's gonna take me through his gnarly leg workout. It's gonna be sick. So let's see the spray card real fast. Oh. This isn't black and white right now. So. This is the official color of the GTR. This is the actual spray card for the color of the R35. You guys can't see it just yet, but it's absolutely amazing. It is everything that I could have wanted. This is the first actual spray card of the R35 build. It means a lot, so I get to keep it. And I'm actually gonna do something pretty special with it once we have the car completely finished up. You guys are gonna be pretty hyped about it. But like I said, let's go to the gym. 
All right, we have made it to the gym and you guys have been asking for a leg day. So I thought, actually, today's probably my last leg day of the entire prep. Um, we are 14, 15 days out. So this will be my last like real hardcore leg day. And we are here with my workout partner, Russell, right here. Russell is actually classic physique champion. He's just an animal. So of course, my last leg day, he's gonna absolutely demolish me. And I thought only right to film this because you guys have been wanting a leg day. So we're gonna get a gnarly, gnarly leg pump today. Russell, what do we got today? What are we doing? It's gonna be it's gonna be drop sets for days. <laughs> if I'm if gonna he, hate if you, he, by if he doesn't throw up, <laughs> then my I don't yeah. I don't want this. I don't want this. Good thing about today is I do have another refeed, so I am carved up a little bit. I've had two meals so far. What do you think four packets of cream of wheat are in, in cal carbs? 210, ca 210 carbs? Around 200 carbs. I've had 200 carbs, around 200 carbs today, so I'm feeling pretty good, but uh, we'll see how long that lasts. We're gonna start out with some, Russell calls these good girls, bad girls, but some uh, abductor and adductors. And we're gonna superset here. He's a madman. He's crazy. Oh, fuck. Come on. Definitely one of the craziest leg days I've ever had. Russ is an absolute animal. Don't mess around. This is why you need a workout partner in the gym, especially when you're two weeks out. I would have not have had a workout like this if I didn't have Russ with me. So, uh, so motivated right now. You're mad, man. Come on, Russ. <clears throat> Three more.
That's it. Oh, thanks, bro. I'd say we did a we did a good leg day today, Russ. Give a Solid. quick plug to my boy Russell over here. He is a phenomenal bodybuilder, and I take a lot of inspiration from him. But Russell likes to eat food just as much as I do, and I've been trying to convince him that he needs to start a channel because this man eat, bro. Yeah, so I, I need to. I don't think everybody's ready to see the <laughs> quantities of food I'm eating. But uh, after my prep, we actually have like a couple videos planned to do together. We'll do like 10,000 calorie challenges. Russell will probably be more about 25,000 <laughs> calories. Yeah, stay tuned for all that. I actually have to hit 50 minutes to hit cardio, but crush some legs, bro. Oh, Thank yeah. you for taking me through. My last leg day before prep. Yeah. All right, just finished up with the lift and my 15 minutes of hit. Let me give you guys a quick physique update. Like I said, I've had around 200 carbs so far today, and this is after a full workout uh, in both of my cardio sessions. Two weeks out, refeed, I'm feeling good, so we're gonna go home and we're gonna go eat. All right, just made it back from the gym. My post-workout meal for the refeed, if you guys watch this video that I'm currently editing. 10 ounces of sweet potato and four ounces of tuna steak. I actually already ate a little bit of this because I'm starving, but this is what I'm having post legs. I'm feeling really, really good, which is awesome. We're gonna go ahead and eat this. Oh, this was so nice. One of my favorite things to do while on prep, especially after hitting like a really big back day, leg day or whatever, is coming to sit in the hot tub and just relax my muscles, kind of chill out for a bit. And Tiana's actually been home a lot more this time. So we've been getting to spend some time and she gets to deal with me while I'm on prep. It's great. We are finishing out our night with my final meal, which is gonna be eight ounces of salmon and some asparagus. And since uh, we are quarantined to the house now, Tiana's been studying a ton because she doesn't have to travel for work. But I also started this show called The Boys on Pro on Amazon Prime. It's really good. If you guys like like superhero, like aggressive TV shows, it's really good. It's very gory. Like, I don't know. It's about if, if superheroes were real and the government owned them and like they traded them. I don't know. It's really crazy, really good. If you have Amazon Prime, you should definitely check it out. But I'm gonna go ahead and smash this meal. That's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the GTR update and the leg workout with Russ. We absolutely killed it. I have 13 days left into my show, which is absolutely insane. We are almost there, keeping my hopes up and my head high that the show is gonna be totally fine, which I think it will be, so we'll see. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please like this video and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with everything that we have going on. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.